All right, so trying to change these guys to show two different aspects of the subject, whoever this is. Um, so remember everything we've already done, right? I could definitely put filters on these guys to make them look different. But a filter doesn't have to be used on the whole thing. And um, sometimes it's it's even more interesting if you're just using it on, on part of something. I don't like this little section right here. Right here. This pink section. Just the part where it ends. I tried smudging it out. I didn't like that. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do, let me get, grab a little bit more of this just to make it artistic. All right, I'm going to take that section and just put a filter on it. Um, so look at what layer I'm on. I'm on just the pink layer, right? It's just that part that I want to change. So come over here to filter and maybe just do one of those. Uh, all right. Let's make this, make it a little bigger. No, make it a little smaller. Cool. Okay, I like that a little bit better. Um, you already know how to apply filters. What I showed you today was something a little different. This guy over here is whiter than white. Um, I can come up to image and adjustments, right? This is where I went to turn the photo into black and white. Went to adjustments, image adjustments, black and white. But the other thing I showed you was a photo filter. I'll show you that again. Come over here to image, adjustments, photo filter. All right, and remember, depends on what layer you're on. I didn't want to be on that layer. I want to be on this guy. It's not going to let me change it while that's open. So undo that. Come over to this layer with the guy on it. And now do it again. Image, adjustments, photo filter. All right. So changed, made him kind of orangey. That is not a good look. Um, I'm going to change the color. Make it a nice sort of blue-green. How about that? All right, and then that's still just a little too subtle for me. Um, so I can unclick this box right here, the preserve luminosity box, right? If I'm preserving the luminosity, it's leaving the whites white. If I uncheck that box, it makes the whites into whatever color I chose. And if it's a little too dark, I'd slide this guy back and forth. All right. But the difference is I'm adding the color to the white parts or adding the color to the dark parts. Doing it like that. All right, that was the photo filter. Remember, it's under image adjustments, photo filter.